What's up guys, he King back again. Uh, this is just a quick update. I did find more information regarding the uh, bleach, the bleach stuff. So uh, let me read this quickly as well, because you're gonna love this. Um, this is Kubo's, this is Kubo's comments regarding this entire project. So um, uh, this is from Weekly Shonen Jump. Kubo says, burn the witch will be a short term serialization. He also says that by the time we'll be reading, He'll be playing Animal Crossing and he wants to play with everyone. He also mentions he didn't have in mind to start the series, but the, that but that editor encouraged him to do it. So, it's going to be short. Short and sweet, I guess. I'm curious how many... May, maybe it'll be like 10 volumes or something. Uh, I'm trying to think, like, maybe maybe a good year, maybe, or something. Maybe four, maybe... I don't know. I, I, I wouldn't mind if this is a decent length, you know what I mean? And we can just get like a decent anime adaptation of it, like a good 25 to 12, 25 episodes, just so we can get a good idea of how Western soul society society works, basically, the Western branch. Uh, Kubo, it has been so much time, probably, or probably almost everyone forgot about it, and actually, I also forgot. I thought the thousand year blood war arc wouldn't be animated so i didn't expect the animation project in this 20th anniversary there's also the continuation of burn the witch that i didn't that i didn't plus plan to serialize and only showed it to my family and close ones because of pure curiosity as a result my editor saw it and told me to make it a series and animate it it's the first time i'll be drawing manga and anime designs at the same time i think it'll be interesting and overall a good work by the way i have finished the manuscript by the time you read the series i'll be playing animal crossing and so i'm looking forward to play it with everyone okay okay that's sweet that's uh it's good to see that kubo is in uh good relations with the with with, uh, with uh, i guess uh suishi and uh because like you know we, we've, we've all heard the rumors like that he was forced to quit or that he was ill and he just sort of cancel the project we'll never know what it really was i honestly think it was a mix of both i think it was a case of it was a case of he was sick but he was really struggling to try and finish the manga in in a good way i don't mind the ending my problem is is that everything that happens between uh when the miracle gets like his third form and the final battle i think everything between then is where everything just got sort of modeled, modeled and rushed because there's a lot of stuff they could have still packed in there to sort of give it more depth i mean I think we all wanted to have a proper final battle with Aizen and Yuwa and Janichiko and that, but there's a lot of stuff missing. The four bringers were pretty much wasted, only appearing at the very end to do sort of an ex machina. Uh, Ichigo's dad, Uriel's dad, just here for like one second just to give an arrow. Like they didn't fight at all, so that was completely pointless. Uh, uh, Nail jumps into the dome to save uh, Kisuke, Yorichi, her brother, and Grimcha. We never saw how they got them out. We never saw what happened to Halibar when she was in uh, Watch's little sex dungeon. Um, uh, Rangiko was, after, was supposed to have a major review and a bigger role and I think a lot of these things were obviously answered in the uh, like canon novel that came out uh, what was it called uh, can't can't fear your own world I think can't fear your world or something uh, uh, that came out so and that was like three volumes I believe I haven't read it personally I've only read bits of it from the first volume but I'm waiting for the official translations in English to come out before I read it but uh, that, that could be they could use elements of that to expand the final arc as well and to give it more of a, a, a close end because there were a lot of loose ends and then they could just adapt those novels and carry on with the story from there like uh which i hope they will they will do like i hope it's not just a case of we're adapting the final plot we will adapt the canon novels as well and give it a proper proper ending that bleach deserves but uh yeah uh overall i'm i'm happy guys i'm so happy we're getting this like it's crazy it's so bloody crazy like oh in this time as well in this time i needed i needed great news and for me this is great news this is the best news i could get because it's one of the best news i mean the only thing that could top this right now is if george r martin came out and said yo i'm releasing winds of winter next month or something like oh it's coming up this year don't worry it's definitely coming up this year 100 percent. that would be the news that tops that like okay but uh I, I doubt that's gonna happen okay i doubt that's gonna happen or maybe it will maybe it will you know you gotta keep hope right that's the whole thing you gotta keep hope in this day and age especially now the best thing you could have is hope. Guys, Bleach is back. What, how many times can I repeat it? It's back. Like and subscribe guys and I shall see you and I shall see you. Take care and bye.